I'm coming up to six months withdrawal and things are not as good as I thought they were going to be. Hello, I'm here to see Dr Emma. Uh, OK, if you'd like to take a seat. Thank you. It makes me feel really sad for her that she's put so much of her life on hold for something that I know is not going to give her the results that she wants. So I kind of got to the point now where I'd quite like some help. Hi, Louise. Hello, Emma. Hi. Thank nice you for seeing me. My pleasure. I really wanted to see you. Come Thank with you. me. This is a really, really difficult situation. When people have such fixed beliefs, they are very difficult to try and change their minds. And I really want to be able to help her skin quickly with steroids, but I'm never going to be able to use these because it's something that she really, really won't accept. You're good. Thank you. When I saw you the last time, the skin was quite red yep. and was quite flared, particularly on the face. Yep. But this looks, um, this looks worse than last time. What's happened since then? You were going to carry on with your yeah. kind of treatment regimes because, yeah. you know, you were so invested in it. Emotionally, it's been quite difficult. And I thought I'd be a lot further on, coming up to six months. Yeah. And I'm not. And I kind of want to get on with my life now. Yeah. Your problem now is not a steroid withdrawal. Your problem now is your eczema is kind of infected and it's flaring. I mean, ideally, I would love to just give you a two-week course of steroids, a week course of antibiotic, loads of emollient and wet wraps, and your skin would be completely different in two weeks' time. Uh, I wouldn't use topical steroids mm -hmm. ever again, I don't think. It just kind of makes, like, the last six months, like, redundant. I do believe in this, like, because I've done, like, endless research. I've seen people recover from it. You know, the steroids that you're using on your skin are well, 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 well gone. <laughs> it just makes me feel really sad and really frustrated looking at her skin that is very severe. And, you know, we have all of these things that we can use to help her. And I just hope that she might start to open her mind to some of the more conventional ways of treating her eczema. I just want to get you better as quickly as possible. I know, I know.